Feeling like you're smiling in the morning Following the linings on your cheeks Cause baby, yeah. Hello everyone, welcome to a brand new video. So, as you've seen by the little intro clips, I am currently in Mexico, specifically Puerto Escondido, which is in Oaxaca, and it's in, you guys like on the coast. It's a very like hippie-ish town. There's so many foreigners here. I don't know if that makes sense, like from all over the places. You hear all sorts of different languages, accents, all of that. So it's pretty interesting. It's my first time here and I'm excited, but I figured I'd do a little what I eat in a day um, in Mexico. So I'm gonna play a quick little, quick little clip here of what I ate kind of like pre-breakfast, um, the place where we're staying at, they brought us, sorry for all the background noise by the way, but the place we're staying at, which I've already shown a little bit of intro, um, they brought us breakfast, or I guess like the pre-breakfast, it's basically just like fruits, so we ate some fruit, and then yesterday we did buy some mango because I've been in the mood for some mango, so we also did eat mango, fruit, some coffee, and right now we're on our way on our little scooter you'll see in a second um we're gonna go find a place where we can take surfing lessons because puerto escondido is like known for surfing has really nice waves and that's also why there's a lot of like foreigners here because a lot of people come here to surf so we're gonna go do that um i'll show you little clips here and there but this will mainly be just kind of like what i eat in a day i'm not tracking i'm not doing anything special really just kind of eating and enjoying. Panini de, panini de pollo con chimichurri. Mira. ¿De qué es? Cuéntanos. Se llama omelette. Omelette en inglés. Omelette for tough. And it has cheese, spinach, red peppers, and something else I can't remember. Okay guys, so we just got back. I kind of want to also do a little like what I spend in a day or I guess like with each meal, I'll show you guys, you know, how much it costs and stuff. So we just finished breakfast, to be honest, I was super full so I didn't even finish my meal, but it was really good and as you can see it was 360 pesos, which is about 18 US dollars. But honestly, it's a pretty cheap place to eat, so once you're here, I guess like the stay is a little bit more expensive than, you know, the food. But yeah, breakfast, the fruit this morning was obviously free because it was kind of like included with the room. But yeah, um, we're gonna be, it's about like almost 11.30 and at 12 we're gonna go do a surf lesson. I don't have a GoPro or anything so I'm not gonna bring you guys with me but since this is a full day of eating, I'll see you later for lunch. But yeah, I'm kinda nervous. I'm kinda nervous about the whole surfing thing but I think I got it. Um, so yeah, I'll talk to you guys a little bit later. Outfit change. We got back from surfing a little bit ago, but man, that was tiring. It actually went really well. Um, got up on my first try and it did pretty good. I'm pretty proud of myself. I think uh, growing up doing like wakeboarding, stuff like that definitely helps. So very fun. We'll definitely try again, but that was exhausting. My arms, my legs, my whole body is tired and I'm hungry. So we're going to go eat. I think we're gonna go eat some ceviche, but I'll take you along, show you what we get. So yeah, let's hop on the scooter.
Okay, so we're back. The food we just ate, so good. It's uh, ceviche peruano. Very, very good. And this meal was on the more expensive side that we've eaten um, so far, but that's because we each had like our separate ceviches and then we also got a sashimi. So it was very good. The total was about like 35-ish do US dollars, like 700 pesos, but yeah. We came back, we're chilling for a little bit. Uh, we're gonna go catch sunset later. I'll bring you guys along, but we had to stop and buy some mantecadas because I love mantecadas. So I'll probably have one of these, but I mainly wanted these for like my coffee in the morning. Delicious. But yeah, that's all I got for you. I'll see you at dinner and at sunset. my friends a full day of eating complete um, we may still go out to be to be continued we're not sure if we want to go out or not but dinner was really good it was only like 15 US dollars for both hamburgers and a frozen mojito which is really good so as I kind of forgot to record until like I already taken a few bites, but we basically had I had a chicken Burger basically it was called Bob Marley um, And it was really good. It had like good cheese on it overall very good and then David got a just like a regular burger with cheese and bacon and caramelized onions very cheap, very good, very delicious, and the frozen mojito was very good as well, so yeah. I hope you enjoyed, I'm gonna end this video off here, and yeah, let's, let's be more consistent, and I guess, as you guys saw, I didn't really restrict uh, many things this. While I'm on vacation, I really like to enjoy, especially when I'm like in a different country, you know, enjoy the food, enjoy the culture, and so I really don't restrict anything. Um, if I want it, I'll eat it, but yeah, just listen to your body, listen to what you want. Obviously, if you're feeling sick, maybe don't eat some things because that was kind of what happened to me, but I'm feeling much better because I've just been kind of taking care of myself, but yeah, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in the next video. Mwah. Thank you.